Do you know the warning signs of prostate cancer? This is a question that every adult should be able to answer affirmatively. Prostate cancer is a serious health issue that affects countless lives worldwide, and the importance of early detection cannot be overstated. In this video, we're going to delve into the topic of prostate cancer, a disease that primarily affects men, particularly those over the age of 50. It's a silent invader often showing no symptoms until it's advanced. But by being aware of the warning signs, we can potentially catch it early, increasing the chances of successful treatment. We'll be discussing 10 warning signs of prostate cancer. These are not definitive proof of the disease, but they can serve as an alarm bell, a signal to seek medical advice. Remember, knowledge is power, and by understanding these signs you're arming yourself with the information necessary to take proactive steps towards maintaining your health. The signs we'll be discussing range from changes in urinary habits to unexplained weight loss. Each of these signs could indicate a variety of health issues, and it is crucial to consult with a healthcare professional if you notice any of them. It's important to note that having one or more of these symptoms doesn't necessarily mean you have prostate cancer, but they are worth paying attention to and discussing with your doctor. Throughout the video, we'll be breaking down each warning sign, explaining what it may look like in your day-to-day -day life, and providing some context as to why it might be a sign of prostate cancer. This video is not a substitute for professional medical advice, diagnosis, or treatment. Always seek the advice of your physician or other qualified health provider with any questions you may have regarding a medical condition. Being aware of these signs can help detect prostate cancer early and increase the chances of successful treatment. Remember the goal is not to scare, but to educate and empower. So, let's get started on this journey of knowledge and awareness together. Firstly, frequent urination can be a sign of prostate cancer. This symptom, often more noticeable during the night, can indicate that something is off in the body. The prostate gland surrounds the tube that carries urine from the bladder out of the body. As such, when a tumor grows in the prostate, it may press on this tube, causing a need to urinate more often. This symptom is not exclusive to prostate cancer and may occur due to other conditions such as a urinary tract infection or simply as a result of natural aging and changes in the body's functionality. However, if you find yourself waking up multiple times during the night to use the bathroom, it's worth discussing with your healthcare provider. Keep in mind while this symptom can indicate prostate cancer, it can also be due to other conditions or even natural aging. Our second warning sign is difficulty starting and stopping urination. You might wonder why this happens. Well, the prostate is a small gland that sits below the bladder and surrounds the urethra, the tube that carries urine out of the body. When the prostate becomes enlarged, it can press against the urethra, affecting the flow of urine. This can lead to difficulties in starting or stopping urination, a warning sign that shouldn't be overlooked. It's important to understand that these symptoms are not exclusive to prostate cancer and can also be associated with benign prostate conditions or even a urinary tract infection. However, persistent changes in your urinary habits, especially if you're over 50, should never be ignored. It's always better to be safe than sorry. Remember, early detection is key in managing and treating prostate cancer. It's crucial to not ignore these changes and seek medical advice if you notice them. The third warning sign is a weak or interrupted urine flow. That's right, if you find that your usual gush has turned into a trickle, it could be a symptom of prostate cancer. Here's why. The prostate gland surrounds the urethra, the tube that carries urine from the bladder out of the body. When the prostate gland enlarges due to cancer, it can squeeze the urethra, affecting the flow of urine. Now it's important to note that a weak urine flow could also be a symptom of other conditions, such as an enlarged prostate or urinary tract infection. It's not a definitive sign of prostate cancer, but it's definitely something you should bring up to your healthcare provider. So, if you've noticed a change in the strength or consistency of your urine flow, don't ignore it. Remember, these symptoms could be due to other issues as well, but it's always better to get them checked. The fourth warning sign is pain or burning during urination. Now this is not a symptom to take lightly. When your prostate gland, which is located just below the bladder, becomes enlarged due to cancer, it can press against the urethra. This is the tube that carries urine from your bladder out of your body. This pressure can cause discomfort, pain, or even a burning sensation during urination. 
It's important to note that these symptoms can also be signs of other conditions, such as urinary tract infections or bladder disorders. However, if you're experiencing persistent pain or burning during urination, it's a strong indication that something is not right. Ignoring these symptoms or hoping they'll just go away can lead to delayed diagnosis and treatment. Remember early detection is key in managing prostate cancer. Experiencing pain during urination is definitely not normal and should be discussed with your doctor. The fifth warning sign is blood in urine or semen. Now, this is a symptom that can understandably cause a lot of alarm. Prostate cancer can sometimes cause blood vessels to rupture, leading to the presence of blood in urine, a condition known as hematuria, or in semen, known as hematospermia. While it's important to note that blood in urine or semen can be caused by a number of other conditions like infections or inflammations, it's also a potential indicator of prostate cancer. The presence of blood may not always be visible to the naked eye. Sometimes, it's only detectable under a microscope during a routine checkup. This is why regular medical examinations are so crucial. Any form of blood in your urine or semen, whether visible or not, should immediately be reported to a healthcare professional. It's always better to be safe than sorry when it comes to matters of health. The sixth warning sign is erectile dysfunction. Now, let's take a moment to explore how prostate cancer might be linked to this condition. Erectile dysfunction, or ED, is when a man has difficulty achieving or maintaining an erection. But how does this relate to prostate cancer? As you may know, the prostate gland plays a significant role in sexual function. It produces seminal fluid and helps propel this fluid during ejaculation. When prostate cancer develops, it can interfere with these processes, potentially leading to ED. Furthermore, some treatments for prostate cancer, such as surgery or radiation, can also cause ED. Remember, erectile dysfunction can be a result of many different factors, not just prostate cancer. However, if you're experiencing ED along with other warning signs we've discussed, it may be worth bringing up with your doctor. While it can be a sensitive topic, it's important to discuss any sexual health changes with your doctor. The seventh warning sign is persistent pain in hips, back, or chest. This may seem odd, but it's essential to remember that our bodies are interconnected systems. Prostate cancer specifically can metastasize, spreading beyond the prostate and into other areas of the body, causing discomfort or pain in seemingly unrelated locations. For instance, the prostate is near the lower back, hips, and pelvic region, so the pain can radiate outwards. Similarly, if the cancer has spread to the bones, it might cause pain in the chest area. It's easy to dismiss these aches and pains as the result of aging or overexertion. However, if you notice a persistent pain that's not related to any known injury or strain, it's crucial to seek medical advice. A persistent pain, especially when combined with other warning signs we've discussed, could be a red flag for prostate cancer. Persistent pain should always be investigated, even if you think it might not be serious. The eighth warning sign is weakness or numbness in legs or feet. This may seem unrelated to prostate cancer, yet it can be a significant telltale sign. The prostate is located near the spinal cord which controls our ability to move and feel. If a malignant tumor grows and begins to press on the spinal cord, it can create a host of problems, including the weakness or numbness in the lower extremities. This can manifest as a lack of strength, a feeling of heaviness, or an inability to move the legs or feet as freely as before. Or it could even be a pins and needles sensation similar to when your foot falls asleep. If you've noticed such changes, it's crucial to bring them to your doctor's attention. This isn't about causing undue alarm, but about being proactive with your health. Don't overlook these symptoms as they can be an early sign of something serious. Uh, the ninth warning sign is loss of bladder or bowel control. This sign can be quite distressing and embarrassing for those experiencing it. Prostate cancer can cause this by pressing on the nerves that control these functions. This pressure can lead to issues such as incontinence, where you may find it difficult to control when you urinate or pass stool. It can also lead to constipation or diarrhea. These changes might be gradual, starting with minor accidents and increasing in severity over time. Or they could be sudden, causing a drastic change in your daily routine. It's worth noting that while this symptom is a potential indicator of prostate cancer, it can also be a sign of other health issues such as urinary tract infections, bladder disorders, and other types of cancer. Therefore, any changes in bladder or bowel control should not be ignored. They should be reported to a doctor immediately. It's always better to be safe than sorry when it comes to your health. 
The tenth and final warning sign is unexplained weight loss. Prostate cancer can have a sneaky way of affecting your body. Unexplained weight loss is one of those subtle effects. You might not think much of it at first or you may even welcome it. But if you're shedding pounds without a change in diet or exercise, it may be a cause for concern. The reason behind this is pretty straightforward. Our bodies need energy to function, and when you have cancer, your body uses more energy than usual to repair and maintain cells. This ups your calorie demands, causing weight loss. In the case of prostate cancer, the tumor can also release substances that alter your metabolism, accelerating this process. It's important to remember that weight loss can be a sign of many health conditions, not just cancer. However, if you're losing weight and you don't know why, it's a good idea to speak with your doctor. While weight loss can be due to a variety of reasons, it's essential to rule out serious conditions like prostate cancer. So there you have it, the 10 warning signs of prostate cancer. Each of these signs, from frequent urination to unexplained weight loss, is a potential beacon, alerting us of the possible presence of this disease. But remember, these are just warning signs, not a definite diagnosis. Experiencing one or more of these symptoms doesn't necessarily mean you have prostate cancer, but it does mean you should consult your doctor. Now why is this important? Because early detection is crucial when it comes to battling prostate cancer. Discovering the disease in its early stages greatly increases the chances of successful treatment and survival. And it's not just about survival. Early detection can also mean a better quality of life, as treatments for advanced stage cancer can be more aggressive and carry more side effects. Let's recap. Frequent urination, difficulty starting and stopping urination, weak urine flow, pain or burning during urination. These are the signs related to urinary function. If you notice changes in these areas, it's time to have a conversation with your doctor. Then we have blood in urine or semen, erectile dysfunction, pain in hips, back, chest, weakness or numbness in legs or feet, loss of bladder or bowel control, and unexplained weight loss. These signs may indicate that the cancer has spread beyond the prostate. Again, if any of these signs are present, it's important to consult your doctor without delay. That's what this all comes down to, taking action. Prostate cancer is a silent enemy, often showing no symptoms until it has advanced. That's why regular checkups are so crucial. They provide a critical line of defense in the battle against this disease, allowing for early detection even before symptoms arise. In conclusion, understanding these warning signs and acting upon them can make a world of difference. It's not just about adding years to your life, but adding life to your years. Remember, early detection is key in the fight against prostate cancer. Don't ignore these warning signs and make regular appointments with your doctor. And that brings us to the end of our discussion on the warning signs of prostate cancer. I hope this information has enlightened you, and may it serve as a beacon in your journey towards better health. This isn't just about you, it's about the men in your lives. Your fathers, your brothers, your sons, and your friends. Share this knowledge with them, because early detection can make all the difference. Health is not a destination, it's a journey. This journey is filled with choices and making your health a priority is one of the most important choices you can make. Remember, the power to maintain good health is in your hands. Your feedback drives this channel forward. Whether it's a suggestion, a personal story, or just a simple hello, I'd love to see your comments below. Your interaction makes this community stronger and helps us all learn from each other. Don't be shy, join the conversation.